In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to animate text in PowerPoint. So let's delete this slide. We're gonna delete this slide. I have this text here. We can even create a new one. We can go to insert. And here we have shapes. We also have um, here the option to add text, text box. And here let's enter some text i'm gonna enter here some nice text this is just some dummy dummy text but you can add your own text let's increase this text i'm gonna share the font for this text let's use this one and uh, now Let's increase this text and from here in transitions, we can add some animate this text. We can add transition, but to animate is from here. You have uh, different ways to animate this text. Look at this one, fly in, which is pretty nice. This uh, also in a slide, uh, not in slideshow, but in design, I'm gonna change this to white screen ensure fit and here you can also format the background so we have uh, gradient solid pattern fill picture texture fill solid is just one color gradient we can add a gradient that looks uh, pretty nice we can create really nice effect here so for instance i can add a radiant here I can add here a color, let's say this black or this bl uh, this blue. And now, what I can do now is to add maybe here another one or the same one. And I can go in the middle here, which is this one. So let's zoom out. I'm gonna increase here more colors. I'm gonna increase the color. Um, the value here and I'm gonna go like this and go with this one like this so we have this effect with gradient as I said if you want to change the background format the background just click on here we also have picture or texture fill can go to clickboard and now if you copy something let's say you copy this image or any image from the internet if you go to format background and you click on clickboard background it will add that image from the click uh, clipboard all right pretty cool and um, now we have the text but uh, maybe we like to add a solid background and a gradient or a pattern now we have the text, but to add animation, it's from here as I showed you. But maybe you would like to see this animation, which will start from here. But maybe you would like to see animation that will start from top, maybe like this. And we have to go to animation pane. Make sure you don't have other animation here that will interfere with your text animation. Or well, not that interferes, but maybe you want the first is the first animation to start will be the text you want the text to be the first so here we'll see which one is the text well is this one now if we grab this right in front now we have the text first and then the other ones we can even delete the animation for the text you can right click and remove or you can select it and click on delete on your keyboard of course, we can also delete even the text, of course, and uh, the text here. I'll just select here and click on delete really fast. And uh, now we have this animation, select the text, but we can also maybe we'll, we, will, we would like to add a a fly in and then fly out so what you have to do is to click on add animation here and select fly out now we have a fly in 
fly out and uh, we can select the duration here to fly to top to bottom so let's play the on again and I see it works and uh, we can even let's remove and we can add again now uh, maybe a fly in so now we have a fly in add animation and I fly out fly in fly in this one should be fly from the bottom flying from top and then from the bottom to bottom let's see now okay but we like to increase the duration so in order to increase the duration of this animation you have to see this uh, icon here and then they just then just increase like this and now if we play all as you can see it's much slower right now and uh, that's what you have to do to make this much slower and uh, now we can also right click on this select effect properties and here we have a lot of options so we can smooth start if you want to smooth start just increase this to 11 seconds or how much you want and you can even have sound here timing start on click let's start with previous delay you can add delay or even some text animation here so there is a lot of options now i like to make this shorter so let's see now as you see, as you can see it's lower at the beginning we can add this effect to this um, fly out as well slower and then fast we can decrease this the timing and uh, now animate text but we can uh, animate our text uh, we can even add third animation to this we can add animation in here we can select maybe um, shape animation so now we have three animation added to this text so let's play all Can increase this or move this in between and now let's see now can even move this so it starts right here so there's a lot of options to create a very nice animation we can affect control and here is mode start path unlock timing zero on click let's see what previous not on click and let's play again And we can move this back here let's see so yeah that's the tutorial for today i hope you found this helpful thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next video if you have any questions related to this uh to the power to powerpoint let me know in the comment section i'll create a tutorial for you thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next uh, video take care